I got brides in Atlanta, she's a dog in the family, credit cards in the scammers, he in the looks in the band, legacies. Pra gente, por gentileza, você tem. Ah, é um lógico. Você tem uma cinturinha e o popozão. Aí, ó, só de dar uma mexidinha, ó o efeito que causa, ó lá, ó lá. Foi exatamente tá antes de você ir embora. This is obvious. Get him, kid. Oh, 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 per una cifra intorno ai 30.000 pound a settimana. Voi sapete che qui in Inghilterra i giocatori vengono pagati a settimana e eh, appunto eh, si trasferirà alla, fi alla fine delle visite mediche. Sembrava esserci stato qualche... No idea he could do that, and I heard this noise. Yeah. At first, I thought it was Pikachu. My kids are big now. I forget Pika, about Pika, Elmo. Pikachu. I can do that one too. The Playboy Mansion's been sold after months on the market for one hundred million dollars. If those walls could talk. <laughs> the new owner, I should say, is a ninety-year-old co-owner of Hostess. So that's a lot of ding dongs and pinkies. <laughs> I, I'm not. I shouldn't have gone there, and I will not go there. I didn't even think about it. But there's a little devil on the there. So let's just keep going. <laughs> <laughs> a trip to the beauty salon has ended awkwardly for a couple in China. Their four-year-old son somehow got his head stuck inside a gap in a sofa. Firefighters had to be called in to rescue the child in the country's southwest. <laughs> Sorry. Just ahead in Nine's afternoon news, caught on camera, the angry resident throwing eggs at a real estate agent. <laughs> Donald Trump finally sticking to the script. <laughs> I think we better just take the break. <laughs>
Hi there. Uh -oh. <laughs> You've been cleaning up your basement and we're cleaning up the backyard here, it looks like. <laughs> it's a little loud out here this afternoon. Tell them to turn off the blower. <laughs> All right. Uh, good afternoon for any activities you may be. <laughs> Yeah, now we can. Okay, we can. I, can't, I can't hear myself. <laughs> Apparently, he doesn't know what this business Sir, is. Sir, you're on television. <laughs> That's what we do here. We appreciate the work he's doing. Though. We do, we do. And it's maybe a good afternoon to clean up <laughs> your yard as well. I don't know if I can do this. We do have a lot of clouds across the area right now. A few <laughs> breaks in the clouds. You're right. <laughs> so we can <laughs> I think we've lost her. Uh, <laughs> I'll tell you what, we'll do that. Come back to me on camera three. <laughs> <laughs> now, let's get a weather update. Here is Louise Lear. Thank you, Simon. Good evening, everybody. I'll try and keep it together because it's not a laughing matter with the weather in Scotland today's view. <laughs> Sorry. It's been pretty wet and windy with the strongest of the gusts of wind across Scotland and Northern Ireland. In fact, we've seen gale force gusts into Wales and across the rest of the parts of England. We've had some, sorry, we've had some sunshine with highs of 24 degrees. So that's 75 Fahrenheit. Let's move back to this area of low pressure that's been sitting across the northwest. <laughs> Yeah. What's going on? This is amazing. I can do the news like this all the time. This is perfect. I've yes. always kind of wanted to be a mascot. Do you know who's here, Rob? <laughs> can you can you guess? Uh, let me think here. Now I want to see if we can dip the donut in the coffee. All can right. we do that? Oh no, he's gonna go for it. Oh no, don't hurt yourself. <laughs> don't break company equipment. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, oh. get the iPads. And my iPhones. Get and the somebody iPhones. Somebody my computer. Oh, my uh. goodness. I'm getting still stuck down here. I Help bet me. that hurt a latte. So that's <laughs> it. BBC4, so here we go. We're not sure how many of you are still there because there's so much live athletics on the way on BBC1. Let's see what's going on over here. Looks like some sort of hen do. Can we have a little look, do you think? There they go. A Brazilian hen party. They are clearly enjoying themselves. They seem to be all tied together as well. Magnificent scenes. Maybe that's how you do it in Brazil. The bride, the bride. There's the bride. Can we see can we see the bride? There she is. Oh, come on then. Right. Now, this this could be this could be interesting. Come on. What's your name? My name's Maria. Maria, and are you from Brazil? I'm from Brazil, Rio de Janeiro, but now I'm living in Belo Horizonte. Kiss for Minas Gerais. Okay, you're, you're clearly having a very good night, and all your friends are here, and you yeah, are the bride. Friends. When are you getting married? I'm the bride in one month. One month. September 17th. Are all this lot coming to the wedding? Yes! <laughs> I love her. I love, I love everybody. One month. September 17th. Okay, have a beautiful oh, wedding. Oh, thank, thank you very much. much. We'll just see you later. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Right. They just, they just want to, they just want to wave goodbye. Are you out vivo? No, we're BBC. BBC? BBC, yeah. Right. You can leave graciously that way. BBC. BBC! 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 This is lovely. BBC! BBC!
¿Qué, ¡Qué trancazo nos metimos! Oh, que allá arriba de la pobre flaquita. ¡Que baile Betty para irnos a corte! ¡Gracias, maestro Veracamonte! ¡Gracias, Monte. gracias! Y así con esa bonita imagen de Betty en traje de baño, las pieles de Maestro Bracamonte completas. Vamos a un corte comercial y regresamos con mucha más diversión. ¿A quién queremos más? ¡No se mueva! Afternoon. Are we in a rush today? I'd like to start with 78 F-bombs. 